additional safety valves detected. You vented a lot of the pressure, but it's still building. Master control room's the only place to shut it all down, so get there quick.
for playback nearby. Power generator stabilized. Well, nothing's exploded. And that siren stopped, so looks like we're good. I got an engineering team already mobile. They can finish up at the plan. Nothing left for you to do, so I guess you can roll out. for the whole city. <laughs> Only gonna do it if we have to. If our place in the city is not respected. Cause if we don't get a place, then my people will make sure nobody's got a place. And until then, we gonna live. This right here is the I'm funny headed back to Lex. What he's getting at is that we've intercepted me. some audio Hold from on. one of our Your esteemed call. colleagues. He's taking advantage of the situation. We've got to hunt him down. I don't get it. You think there's maybe enough virus going around right now? It's all about the leverage. If I've got my hands on the dollar flu starter kit, this green poison that someone cooked up, then certain people are going to be a lot more reluctant to take a run at me. A gun's a lot better for self-defense than a weaponized virus. Stop thinking small. Start thinking possibilities. There's no medical infrastructure anymore. It's the Wild West out there, but less civilized. Being able to turn certain death loose at any time I want puts me in a powerful position. And controlling the core ingredients for a vaccine, that's useful too. So you might kill even more people. Who's gonna notice? It's not the killing. It's the threat of being able to kill. And giving them the hope they might be saved. The way things are breaking down out there, all these different groups carving their own territories out of what used to be civilization. It only makes sense to have an ace in the hole. He did real good, hooking stuff up. Almost gives a guy like me hope again. <laughs> well, that's a goddamn miracle. I said almost, Agent Lau. So what you found while you were out there is keeping me up at night. Looks like I ain't paranoid after all. I'm just right. I mean, here you got the smartest, most powerful, most weaponized agents in the world, and still, somebody goes off the rails. Yeah, well, they're not gonna win, no matter what you might believe. Oh, you think I'm not on your side, Agent? You think I'm just a cynic who doesn't give a shit? I'm a goddamn patriot. That's why this shit upsets me. You know why democracy works? It's a balance. We don't just got rights, we got responsibilities, too. People don't realize just how fucking precious this shit is. Jury duty, voting. Oh, we can all get away from you in a second. You don't do your bit. Nobody gets a free lunch. Hell, this country is set up so that nobody can go run things by themselves. Balance of powers. And then some asshole decides to create the division. It breaks everything. All of the power, none of the accountability. It's the opposite of everything this country stands for. Of course it didn't work. So now, what do we got left? Good intentions. Hey, and us. All of us. And I've got a hell of a lot more than good intentions. We are gonna do this. And we're gonna do it the right way. I want that to be true, Agent. I do. But I don't see what makes you different from the rest. I just hope for all our sakes that you are.